Sampdoria have only won Serie A once, in the 1990-91 season, and have generally been overshadowed by their city rivals Genoa, who have a longer and more illustrious history. This season, while La Stamp have no chance of taking the title, they are attracting praise for their possession-based attacking style and the form of young midfielder Lucas Torreira, another hot central midfield property developing nicely in the Italian top flight. Sampdoria have played a 4-3-1-2 in every game this season, with a first-choice strike pairing of Duvan Zapata and the evergreen Fabio Quagliarella, playing ahead of Gaston Ramirez or Gianluca Caprari in the hole. The first-choice midfield three sees Torreira sit in the centre, with Edgar Barreto on his right and young Belgian prospect Denis Pratt on the left, although Carol Linetti has also played a significant number of games. The defence, anchored by Gianmarco Ferrari and Matthias Silvestre, play a high line and tend to move up as one, even in possession. While the fullbacks do push up, they tend not to when the centre-backs have the ball, even if there is space. They wait for the ball to go into midfield before pushing forwards. This ensures that the space does not open up behind them to be exploited in the event of a turnover. Sampdoria press cleverly from the front. Zapata, who is strong and quick, actively presses the centre-backs in possession, while Quagliarera tends to drop off, though he does press from the front too. The flanking midfielders on either side are responsible for pressing the fullbacks when the ball is still in the opposition half, while Quagliarera and the attacking midfield press either the opposition anchor midfielder or the passing lanes to central midfield. This allows the Sampdoria defence to keep its high line and shape, as the fullbacks do not engage the press, and also means that the two midfielders are able to stay deeper as they shuffle across, so they can try to cut out any long passes that bypass the press. This pressing style, which transitions well into a back four low block, and the defensive shape mirror the way that Sampdoria attack too. They funnel much of their initial build-up through the centre. The fullbacks stay reasonably aligned with the centre-backs until the ball has transitioned into midfield and can be played in with a pass in a forwards direction. If there is no space to move into, they'll hang back. The centre-backs and Torreira will play the ball between them, much as Napoli do, until the right time to transition forwards occurs. Torreira is the fulcrum of this Sampdoria side and excels as a deep-lying midfielder, capable of reading play to make interceptions, tackling well and shooting from deep. He plays short, sensible passes either to the flanking midfielders, who split wider in possession, or forwards to the attacking midfielder. The flanking midfielders then tend to play in a fullback on the overlap for a cross, recycle it to Torreira, or look to pass through or over the top of the strikers. Gaston Ramirez, formerly of Southampton and Middlesbrough, among others, looks rejuvenated for this Sampdoria side, with eight assists in Serie A so far. Playing behind Cagliarera, who has 17 goals and five assists himself, Ramirez has excelled with deft through balls, layoffs to midfielders arriving from deep, and passes out wide. He uses his physical strength to win the ball back high too, turning defence into attack in dangerous areas. With Cagliarera converting his chances well, assisted ably by Zapata, and the midfield weighing in with a few too, Sampdoria are, if not exactly this season's surprise package, certainly performing above expectations. They can be stymied by teams who attack with high wingers due to the 4-3-1-2's lack of natural width and the opposition pinning back the fullbacks, but against most teams, their combination of incisive passing, possession-based style and intelligent pressing works well. Their blend of experience and potential is also exciting, and if they can maintain their form, Sampdoria will be a welcome addition to European football next season. With the OneFootball app, you can keep up to date with Sampdoria and any other professional team that you would like. Keep an eye on their stats, their league placement and more. There's a link in the description if you want to download it. And uh, thank you very much for watching. Music